Hello Amazon.com, it's me Bo Shevisu. Today I am coming to you with this growler. We're going to finish the entire thing. <laughs> Just kidding, alcoholism is not a laughing matter. But no, let's take a look before we open this guy up. So as you can see, there's a nice little handle right there, which is awfully nice and a nice little steel trap uh, closure right there. There's, um, you'll see once I open it up, there's a, a rubber grommet that really keeps the seal in nicely. But I would like to point out, obviously you can see there's quite a bit of condensation coming off right there. Uh, so I would not actually suggest something like this if you're traveling for more than an hour to get to your destination because you're gonna lose a lot of the chill and your beer will be compromised. Point being, it's not insulated. You can see all of this condensation coming out and you don't want to show up with lukewarm beer and you try to get it cool again. Ah, that's disgusting. But anyway, this is what it looks like and it is full metal or, or I'm sorry, uh, aluminum, which is kind of neat. It's kind of a step up from the, the, uh, the chintzy, cheap kind of glass growlers, you know what I mean? So I just got this, not but 20 minutes ago. So we're gonna go ahead and pop it open Woo! <laughs> That's kind of fun. Uh, nice, good. Wow, that had quite a seal on it. Lovely. And as you can see, it's starting to go out right there. There's quite a bit of head, but of course I am trying to do this with one hand. If you have a big hand, maybe it'll work. I kind of wish there was a handle on it because it's uh, uh, kind of awkward to hold with one hand and do this like so. Holy smokes! And this is a porter, by the way, in case you're wondering. So, um, wow, it's, um, well, that poured quite nicely, um, except for the fact that there's no handle on it. I, I kind of wish there was a handle. Um, but anyway, odds are this is going to be on a countertop, and then you can use both hands to actually pour. So I'm not going to take off some stars for that. Um, yeah, even though I'm awkwardly placed as I'm filming this right here. So anyway, as I mentioned before, you can see kind of the squishy rubber uh, seal right there goes all the way around and this is how you seal it you put it over like so like that very very nice tight seal and there we go excellent and then let's see if it actually leaks out no it doesn't excellent so depending on your use if you are traveling quite a ways let's say you're taking this over someone's house for a dinner engagement uh, I'd probably not suggest this thing. It would be a, a one out of five star. However, if you are on your way home from work, you're having some friends over for dinner, and the growler filling place is not but 15 minutes away from your house, this would be worth it. It would be a five out of five stars, and that's my particular use, so I'm going to give it a five out of five stars. There we go. Very, very unique looking, very cool, uh, lightweight, uh, fairly tough, kept the seal in wonderfully, doesn't leak, relatively easy to pour um, if in fact you have both hands on it. So that's it. My name is Bo Shevisu. I look forward to testing and reviewing more fun things here on Amazon.